He doesn't like the robots. It's awesome. It's like, Screw you, cleaning bot. Well, let's take him back along the path and see what he finds. Oh, look at him go. Look at him go. Hell yeah. That's right. That's how I hack things too. Good job, slime bro. Hell yeah. Always wanted a pet slime. That guy's awesome. Welcome back. I am a friendly pest and today I'm playing Vertigo 2, playing on Oculus Quest 2, streaming this game from my PC over virtual desktop. And believe it or not, it rolled me back to this firefight. So I just had to slog through this again. And this thing's empty. Um, but I, I fought through it because it immediately threw me in here. And now we're going to get back where I was before I logged out last time. For a few minutes. Must have been the magnet interfering. Speaking of magma, uh, this elevator shaft seems to be full of stuff. That is unfortunate. It's okay, quick detour, you're super close to the transit system. Bunch of these fire grenades. Really? As of the day I'm recording this, there's so many game shows coming up. They will have aired, at least the PlayStation one will have, by the time this video is actually published, but they haven't aired as of the moment that I'm playing it. A lot of people are excited about the PlayStation show. Me, not so much. I don't know a PlayStation. I'm really, not really interested in owning a PlayStation either. I recognize that there's a lot of really cool exclusive games that people like a ton, um, but I'm not invested in those franchises because I've never played them. So, not too fussed. What do I do? Looks like maybe I can shoot that cable, huh? But, I hope everybody enjoys the show. I love a game show. I remember E3 back in the day, when all the big companies would come, and I would, I would order food and have friends over, and we'd make a party out of it and watch all the different gaming conventions. And it was awesome. It was super fun to do that. I miss those days. Now everybody's got their own little show. It's not as it's not as much fun as it used to be, but it's still pretty cool. Um, so we're at full health. <laughs> full health, full gear. But we got all this stuff to come back to if we need to. Oh my, oh my. Doing okay on health. Dang, that's a problem.
Bullets are bouncing off, see that? He's got three fires above his head, too. Makes me think you have to make him vulnerable. Which means I'm screwed because I've wasted all the grenades. There's more up there. But my odds are poor. My odds are poor. I've wasted all my resources. Let's see what that does. Only got one of them, see that? So you gotta hit him with three grenades to make him vulnerable to fight him. That one didn't even work. We're gonna die on our first effort, but we'll be better prepared for the second. Yep, got a piece of him. We'll push on here just to learn this. When he comes back up, he's still vulnerable. Not anymore. See that? Okay. That's how you fight him. I think we're screwed. Nice. I have to answer that. Okay, I loaded the checkpoint. And we're gonna give this a shot. I think he's vulnerable when he first showed up. There we go. Crap, it didn't work. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. So, 
That went relatively well after I figured out what to do. Fight him off the steps, that makes a big difference. Of course I wasted my health syringe and there's this thing. Okay. Sweet. Making headway. Man, it's hard to see in here. Bet I was supposed to double back there, yep. Almost, almost. Yeah, baby. Man, you're a pain. How do you like me now? How do you like me now? Yeah. Excellent. That should keep it quiet for the time being. Great specimen. Wish I could bring it in for study. Dang, there's no shortage of these. If you guys are curious about the phone call, it's my eye doctor. I haven't had a checkup in a while. Um, so I blew them off because I don't want to go in. My eyes are, are doing fine. That's terrible advice though. That's terrible advice. I'll probably call him back and have a checkup. Fortunate enough that my insurance does cover it, so it would be foolish to not. Easy. Okay. Feeling good. We got through a boss. Hmm. You're doing a good job, little buddy. What am I supposed to do? There's a door here. That seemed like a unnecessarily large room that I just went through. Okay. By the way, I did knock the difficulty down one peg. Because, to be honest, I found the enemies so spongy and the weapons so weak that I just wasn't having a good time. Fortunately, there's like easy and story below normal. So I just dropped it down one peg to easy. I hope you weren't friendly. Finally, you've reached the pits. The Plank Internal Transit System. You rode it on the way up to the surface as well, right? The station has been idle since evac, of course, but it looks like it's still in working order. There's a train nearby, I'll call it in. Chapter 7, off a rail. Okay, that was my bad. That was on me. Shit. That was the only train anywhere near here. 
I can't control tracks with this, so you're going to have to reroute another train using this station's control tower. Do you see it? Out in the tunnel past the tracks. Make your way to the tower and I'll help you out from there. Okay. Look at all these cleaning bots. What up, bro? Try the other mode. All right. Do you specialize in excavation, construction, reactor, architecture planning? Apply for a transfer to the Planked Internal Transit System team. Anything over here? Oh, weird. I don't move as fast as the escalator. That's odd. It's super uncomfortable. I don't like it. I don't like it. We can go faster though. That's okay. What was that? I saw a laser, bro. Hmm. Let's try something with a little range. Sniper bots. Something to keep in mind. We got this in the laser sight. Highly recommend that upgrade. Because that would have been super difficult without it. Hm. I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Okay. No shortage of them, huh? Well, that's kind of a nice change of pace, actually, to fight something at range. And most of the enemies just charge you all the time. So, actually not mad about that. Full health restored. Gameplay is much more, uh, much more fun on easy. I feel like, oh! Come on, I'm stuck on nothing, bro. I wasn't supposed to run away, I was supposed to watch that go down. Uh, and they had like an invisible wall pop up because probably in testing, everybody ran away. I hate this revolver. Like if you catch them in the teeth, it works awesome. If you got that little bit of weight, 
The, the thing I don't like, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. The thing I don't like, people like weighted guns because they don't flicker and shake. But I've seen light weapons in games not flicker and shake. The thing I don't like about a weighted gun is when I need to make a small adjustment. Like even just a little, like it reacts sluggishly. So weighting the weapon that way just builds latency into the game. So you have to figure out where they're going to be and try to lead them all the time with it because it's going to have latency, right? And some people are going to disagree with me and they love that and I'm happy for you, right? I'm glad you like that. I don't. I like light weapons and I like when they tune the shake out of them. I think that feels good. I think it plays fun. Like I think the weapons and into the radius play as good as... <sighs> I think they play as well as any weapon in any game. We're going to go back and heal real quick. These are going to stand up at some point. I might have to deal with them. Right, any advice in this game? Aim for the head. Like, that seems to have a tremendous damage modifier. I wouldn't be surprised if it was as much as 3x. It makes a huge difference. Take your time. Aim for the head. Get a laser sight so that's possible. I recommend turning the difficulty down. Uh, mine's on easy here, and it feels fair. So I recommend that normal seemed unreasonable, in my opinion. So there's some advice. Uh, otherwise, I don't think it's a bad game. And I would say that my experience is greatly improved already just by bumping it down a difficulty tick. I really wasn't having a, uh, a good time with the combat at normal difficulty. So there's probably some people out here that like normal difficulty. I'm happy for you. Oh, that one disappeared. I'm happy for you. I'm glad you like normal difficulty. I'm glad you like weighted weapons. Okay. You know what I mean? You do you. There was this freaking thing. Look at this. I mean, they're going to activate as soon as I turn these stairs on. Dang it. Like, the button to activate the stairs is probably in there. Knock, knock. Yeah. Aim for the head. Full health restored. Aim for the head. The slime monster from the first game. Stuck on something, that corner of that couch, I guess. It wasn't my intention to just hammer into them like that, but yeah. What do we got in here? These look like regular grenades. We can't carry as many of them. Ooh, health syringe. Hope we don't need fire grenades. Nice. What else is up there? That's all? Okay. Yep. Yeah. Having... having a much better time on this difficulty setting. Huge improvement. Next mob we see is eating this grenade.
Okay, let's go get a spare grenade. The key to turrets is to blow them off their feet. And we will go just a little bit further today. I want these episodes around 30, 40 minutes. I can't go that way. I think that's like, that's long enough uh, that I don't get too irritated long enough that people don't have to invest a whole bunch of time to watch the episode. What's this thing do? Hey, buddy. What are you doing? Me to let you out of there? That seems like a real bad idea. You want out? You want out? Let's find out what happens. Yeah! Wild and free, bro. Wild and free. Now what? You gonna follow me around? Alright, let's go. Let's go. We got a pet slime. You freaking super cool. Hey, look at him go. He fights. Awesome, too. It's got a great, like, jumpy retro vibe. I love it. I hate the weapon weight. Where are we going, slime bro? He doesn't like the robots, it's awesome. It's like, Screw you, cleaning bot. Well, let's take him back along the path and see what he finds. Oh, look at him go, look at him go. Hell yeah. That's right. That's how I hack things, too. Good job, slime bro. Hell yeah. Always wanted a pet slime. That guy's awesome. How freaking cool is that? Well, hell yeah. Must be a big fight coming.
I love the reload mechanic though. Go slime bro. Oh my. Look at him go. Yeah. Yeah, we make a good team, bro. Make a good team, slime, bro. Let's go. Let's go. Freaking cool. I love the music. Music's awesome. Well, it's gonna be a problem. Get it off me, slime bro. That hurt a ton. And I think there's probably a health station nearby. I heard it chirping. Dang it. Oh yeah. This is much more enjoyable on easy difficulty. Much more. Hey, things don't have to be impossible to be fun. Control tower. Let's go to the control tower. That'll be a good stopping point. And today has been super fun, knocking it down to easy. Wow, that is a big crap. That is the biggest crap I have ever seen. Fair observation. You know what? Having a bucket of these. Ah! No! Good job, slime bro. Bucket of grenades is the best way to deal with robots. Now what do we do? Track controls. Continue on holographic interface. Ah, perfect. This is what I can't hack into remote for track switch controls. Figure out how to route another train into this station so you can get the hell out of the recycling center. The control tower can be better at, uh, breaking than I am. Alright, let's see. Comes down there, this side, this way. No. This way. That way. Nope. Now, I want to get back to this side. Let's see, so we're going down here, around here. Can't go right, we have to go left. We could go, we have to go that way. That way. Great, that should do it. It will take a few minutes for the train to arrive, so you should head back to the station floor. And yes, there seems to be a centaur there that you'll have to take care of. No chance that thing lets you onto a train unless it's dead. Hello? 
Hello? Ferris here. I can only talk for a moment. Listen, do you know anything about the Void Delegation? There's this, this space between universes, this higher extra-dimensional space called the Void, which I sort of knew about from some of Brian's experiments. Turns out, the Void has a government, the Delegation, and they seem to be in contact with Nani. Nani won't tell me much, but I think the Void Delegation wants some artifact from this universe. There's some ritual that needs to be carried out to get it back. I'm still translating the rest of the scripture, so I'll know more soon. I'll meet you at the far end of the transit system, okay? I'll be able to disable the BAMS tracking, and we can escape from Brian. Figure out what the hell is going on, and make a plan. What, uh, okay, my connection with you was just jammed. In fact, now, didn't think Plank could do that. Anyway, listen, Centaurs are Plank's most heavily armored security units. Their entire body is essentially invulnerable, even to explosives. Their one weak point is their head, which, of course, has its own shielding you have to break through. Focus your fire there. Good to know. Slime bro's tangled up or something. Full health restored. Okay. We get through this centaur, we'll call it a day. We get stomped by the centaur, we might call it a day. I just got pushed. Need my laser sight, bro. Dang it. Dang it. Bad shooting on my part. Yeah. That wasn't so bad. Nice. Centaur down. Here comes the train, too. Impeccable timing. Impeccable time. Okay. Today was a good day. Today was a good day. Today was a fun day. Putting this on easy, absolutely necessary. Because, like, in my opinion, I'm not getting upgrades quick enough for these. And I could be, like, walking past them and missing it, etc. And my weapons, as they were on normal, the enemies took so much damage and they just kind of ran at me. It was very frustrating. It wasn't fun at all. But on easy difficulty, I feel like it's pretty fair. It's, it's, on, the, it's on the easier side of what I would prefer, and normal's on the harder side of what I would prefer. So I'm going to err on the side of easy and just have a good time with it. We'll sit down here. Oh, think about what we learned today. I'm straight up having a good time now. Like, today was super satisfying. Uh, loved the slime monster companion there while he lasted. Loved the music in those fight scenes. Killing the centaur was cool. Fighting the big robots was actually Come kind on, of fun. train. No use wasting time. Yeah. Fighting the big robots was actually kind of fun. With the weapons being more effective now on easy mode. Had a good time. Had a good time. Hope I remember to edit out my eye doctor calling me. Uh... Otherwise, good episode, good day. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this romp. Uh, continue our push through this game. Don't know how long it's going to take me to get through it, but today was a good day. So this will go up on Monday. Hopefully you're having a good day. Hopefully off to a good start to your week. Uh, hopefully you saw some really cool stuff at the PlayStation show that you wanted to see. Uh, hopefully you're putting together some fun weekend plans. Hopefully you're spending your free time with the people you want to spend your free time with. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting this tiny channel. 
have a nice day.